the asshole for telling my girlfriend I don't like the way our baby looks. Who? My 22 male girlfriend, 23 female, gave birth to our daughter yesterday. The baby was ugly, to be perfectly candid. She's mine and I love her, but she was not a pretty baby. My girlfriend and I were casually chatting before bed and I brought this up, telling her our daughter wasn't exactly easy on the eyes. She was upset, which I find odd. I didn't mean to hurt her feelings. I was just telling her how I felt about our kid. Truth be told, the baby is interracial, half Chinese, half Punjabi. So it was always a possibility that a potential child would be kind of goofy looking. I don't think she had to be offended. Not every child can be cute. My girlfriend hasn't spoken to me since. However, I don't know what to do. Am I the asshole? Uh, yeah. I think there's things you just do not fucking say. What is wrong with him? You're going to go? You're going to tell the person that just literally just wife? Girlfriend. Oh, girlfriend. Okay. You, yesterday. Well, regardless. Just gave birth yesterday. Yesterday. Like at the time of this posting, she had just. Aren't you birth. already like mentally going through shit? Yeah, of you hormones? have the baby blues. Right. And then to drop that, like, hey, our kid looks like shit. They all are ugly when they first come out. That's they what I was going to gonna say. They have to go through a tiny little canal. Half the times their heads are shaped like cones. That's literally what I was going to ask. Is there any baby just born that comes out and it's like future model? I think it's very rare. I'm, I don't want to rule it out because I'm, I'm sure. But, but I have found from TikTok that glow ups are definitely real. Oh, yeah. Whether it be from baby to... I don't know, to grown up or if it's from like teenager to grown up, mm -hmm. there's definitely a lot that happens. I feel like there's a trend like where oh, it shows people from their yearbook. On, based on the, yeah. It's like the, I got guns in the head and they won't go. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then it switches and it goes from like a yearbook photo where they look ridiculous. Oh, God. And then it goes to like modern day where it's like, oh, like glow up. Yeah. So I definitely think even if that's your true thoughts, I think there's times in life, no matter how close you are with someone, there's just, there's no way to always be 100% honest. No, we talked about, we just talked about this. Right. And that's what I mean. Like, I think, sure, that's how he feels in the moment. That's what's going through his head. Have the, just the awareness. decency, awareness to not fucking say it out loud. There's yeah. times it's not even a white lie. It's just keep it to yourself. It, it's not going to help anything. It's not going to, what is it going to, What what's she going to do? Be like, oh yeah, I agree. What do you do? Get plastic surgery for a fucking infant? It's just. This thing just popped out. Some things are left, better left unsaid. In the wise words of Thumper's mom, if you can't say something nice, don't say it at all. And also like, this is kind of one of those things where it's like, okay, what's telling her going to fix? What's it going to change? Also, I'm getting like, I'm getting weird vibes from this. Like, truth be told, the baby is interracial. So it was always a possibility that a potential child would be kind of goofy Yeah, what's looking. up with all that? It feels like a little racist. Yeah. Like it feels, it doesn't feel right to me. And I agree. Me, and again, I'm white. So like, I don't know. But like, I would love for people of color or other ethnicities besides my pasty ass to chime in on this because it just feels like it's I'm, just it feels I, weird I, it's i think we're yeah sure but at the same time i don't think any mix of any race necessarily m makes you want to expect that your kid might look weird because that's what they're insinuating yeah, i think that which makes me think like do you have a problem with your girlfriend being Chinese, right. like your kid going to come out goofy looking because it's just weird. Like you're not implying that you're goofy looking because it's like, well, maybe I don't know. Yes. I get but what it, you're like, saying. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. like a po it's a possibility it could come out goofy looking. Why? Because you, you, your girlfriend's right. Chinese. Like, what are you implying about her? She's goofy looking because yeah. she's Chinese or do you think you're ugly as fuck? Right. That's if, you th if you think you're ugly, then own it. Like I'm an ugly piece of shit. You should own that. I don't think there's any way to say that, oh, I don't like the way I look. So I think my kid isn't going to be the best looking. 
Yeah. So there's know. no correlation. No, genetics are freaking crazy. Genetics is such a flip a coin, roll the dice, throw salt over your back. Like you don't know what you're going to get. It's why like people have gone on TikTok and like used that sound where it's like, I'm Mexican. And the responding voice is like, no, you're not. And they're like, yes, I am. But it's a white passing person. Like you would never look at them and be like, oh, they're Hispanic. They're Mexican. They're black. Like you can be white passing. You could be a bunch of other passings, but like genetics are so wild. So, and again, this thing just popped out. They're all ugly. Most, most, most are ugly. At least I Well, I just think, I think they're beautiful of the moms. I feel like they're when a, when you have a newborn that new, I don't think you can tell. No, you can't so tell. Smooshed There's and no way you can tell what they're gonna look like as a toddler or a teenager or as a grown adult. I don't think there's a way to know. No, they're they've been soaking in amniotic fluid for nine months. They're pruny. They're pruny. wrinkly. They got a cone head. They got long claws. Have you seen their claws when they no. come out? Sometimes their nails are really long. Really? Yeah, I will say my brother. His kid was kind of cute. The one, Eloise was really cute. Emmett came out. His head was, his head was scary. Well, Emmett's a cute kid now, though. Oh yeah, he's adorable. So now. I just think there's no way to know. You can't. It's just you, you a can't weird. Tell. Like you're judging from. The, no, and they're also like from day one. They're fucking kids. Like, and they're everyone's beautiful. Like every single person on this planet is beautiful in their own unique way, as long as you're kind and don't murder people. Because murderers aren't cute. I'm trying to find the picture of my niece. I know it's posted on the gram, but. Like I can't. day one? Yeah, day one. I bopped down to the hospital. Here she is. Look how little she was. But they don't, babies like, now that I'm looking at this, babies don't really look like anything. Mm-mm. Like they're just like, just babies. Like they're just little potatoes. Like she looks like a potato. <laughs> Like, she's got, like, little eyes and, like, some shading. Like, she looks like a potato. Yeah. It's not like they're, like, I don't know. some, But some babies come out with crazy eyelashes and a lot of hair. So, I don't don't know. One of the top comments on this one. Your girlfriend just pushed a watermelon out of her pussy. And within 24 hours, you tell her it's ugly. Right. Yeah. You're the fucking asshole here. And OP goes, it just came up naturally. We were kind of talking. And then I just said it. Yeah. And so someone goes, you're the asshole. Keep that shit to yourself. Jesus. And OP responds, I disagree. It's important to communicate with one another in an intimate relationship. Again. Read. No. Read the room. It, Never say you don't even, that. You don't even need a room to read. It's like internal. There's a natural. There should be something in your mind. That clicks and says, nope, not going to share this. You're not being dishonest by not saying it. No, it's, you don't even know this thing is 24 hours old. And you're not having a lack of communication by not saying it. You're probably strengthening your communication because you're learning what to say and what to not say. That is communication. (laughs) Communication is not saying everything that comes through your mind. True. Because if we did that, we would all be single well no one would have any friends (laughs) also true or like family i don't know you can't there's just i feel like there was a cartoon about this when i was younger that i saw when i was younger where it's like someone had this or a movie where they had this thing where no matter what they thought it was out loud or everyone knew it and it was like a movie where everyone could read each other's minds and everyone it was like turmoil because everyone started going crazy yeah because all those bad internal thoughts that I mean, everyone thinks bad things sometimes, but you don't say them. Exactly. That's what this next comment says, too. It goes, you're the asshole. How in the blue hell did you get a woman pregnant if your social skills are bad enough that you need Reddit to tell you that you shouldn't tell a woman her newborn baby is ugly? Drop the mic. Wow. 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 (laughs) Wow.